She may have the lofty title of Princess of Wales, but to her three children, Kate Middleton is just mum, and her life as a parent seems worlds away from her royal duties. Her job as Princess of Wales requires her to look the picture of poise and professionalism as she carries out her royal duties. But Kate juggles her public workload with another very important role, being a mum. Although she has the family nanny on hand to help, the mum of three is said to be a hands-on parent along with husband Prince William. So once royal duties are over for the day and Kate heads back home to Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis, we take a look at what she's really like. When she's off duty at the family's home of Adelaide Cottage in Windsor, despite her royal status insiders say Kate is just like any other normal mum. A friend once gave an insight into what the 41-year-old is like behind closed doors, explaining that she's very chilled at home but definitely not a pushover and will tell the kids off when needed. They told people, it's a normal, busy family home with kids running around and knocking things over. There's no airs and graces. She is doing that to help her children be more grounded and keep their reality in check. That's what really matters to her. This means that Kate reportedly has rules around the house that she and the children must follow, including one that she is strict on, no shouting. An insider told The Sun, shouting is absolutely off limits for the children and any hint of shouting at each other is dealt with by removal. But rather than be sent off to their bedrooms or to the naughty step when they act up, the royal couple have a different technique, the sofa chat. The source added, the naughty child is taken away from the scene of the row or disruption and talked to calmly by either Kate or William. Things are explained and consequences outlined and they never shout at them. But not only does Kate employ discipline techniques at home, she also reportedly has a secret code she uses if she feels she needs to calm her children, and it apparently works every time. Author Tom Quinn writes in his book Gilded Youth, an intimate history of growing up in the royal family. When Prince Louis misbehaved at the late Queen's Platinum Jubilee, for example, by sticking his tongue out at his mother, Kate's reaction was praised by teams of expert commentators. She apparently used a secret code to calm the children, as she does on occasions, she simply says, let's take a break. But as a former staffer explained, the children know these few words carry far more weight than we might imagine. In the dark at hours, we sigh up for the chain of breaking through the border. Free and free time remain with the free hearts. We spread our wing and take flight. We take a brother ship. The world in different light. Oh, we're shining on the line. Oh, we need a life. We're breaking on the freedom. We're bringing a friend.
generation Only when the confederation are going down Wind and a bottom free We sit on and high when awake and alive But I'm breaking for the breathing and turn to the fresh No one on the can on the show and no, hold it down We divide our freedom through Trying more in freedom from Are we taking We have come, we've come so far. A ledge, the hour of meditation, and the sudden star. And then we then, we then, we're gonna have a crown. We're gonna have every life, we're gonna have every fly. For the freedom, bacon, that good, so till the end. We're shorting on the line, no wind in the life, we're bringing on the freedom. Only when the confederation are going down, we know the bottom free. We sit on the high when awake and alive, but I'm breaking for the beat and the dawn and the fresh. And no one on the can on my shoulder, no, we down. We divide our freedom through trying more in freedom from. Are we taking more freedom from? Are we talking? So not the hater, we feed the boy. During an interview with Giovanna Fletcher for her podcast Happy Mom, Happy Baby, Kate spoke movingly about her life as a parent with William, opening up about details on their family life. When asked if she felt mum guilt, the Princess of Wales replied, Yes absolutely, and anyone who doesn't as a mother is actually lying. She explained that being a parent is a constant challenge and she feels guilty when her children ask her why she does not always drop them off at school. She said, even this morning, coming to the nursery visit here, George and Charlotte were like mummy how could you possibly not be dropping us off at school this morning. It's a constant challenge, you hear it time after time from mums, even mums who aren't necessarily working and aren't pulled in the directions of having to juggle work life and family life. However, fortunately, Kate is supported in her parental role by husband Prince William, who is also a hands-on dad. Once the youngsters are safely tucked up in bed, William is also reportedly on hand to help her unwind. And according to a friend, once the kids are fast asleep, he likes to treat his wife by making her favorite tipple, a gin and tonic. The pal told people, William will bring Kate a gin and tonic. They look after each other, but in different ways. They also added that Kate runs things at home with the kids and the schedules and is hugely involved in every single part of their day.